Living constantly in a survival response can make life so much harder to live. <laughs> Here's why. So I want to tell you a quick story. So when I was getting into embodied mint work, I didn't call it nervous system work at the time, but it was nervous system work many years ago, I started to experience these profound shifts and that's what got me into it. It felt amazing. And I was like, this is magic. I have to go learn this <laughs> and then I need to share it with people because it's really cool. And I was having a conversation one time with the practitioner that I was working with. And I said, you know, the mountains around here are really beautiful. So I live and was living at the time in Western Washington. We have huge mountain ranges here that you can see. They're really beautiful. They have, you know, snow on them and they're gorgeous and it's pretty hard to miss them. They're everywhere. <laughs> and he was saying, well, what, what do you mean? You know, the, the mountains are really beautiful. He was investigating a little bit. I said, well, I just never really noticed the mountains around here. And he thought that was hilarious. Here I was saying like, I really just never noticed the mountains. I grew up here and I just never really paid attention. And what that is, is your nervous system coming out of a very myopic survival response. So when you are in fight or flight, your nervous system senses a lack of safety. You don't feel safe. You don't feel at ease. You feel like there's danger around every corner and you'll probably have real things you can point to, to, to substantiate that because your nervous system does a really good job of finding those things. You, your vision actually narrows. I mean this literally and I mean it metaphorically. You literally don't see your surroundings as much and metaphorically you don't see opportunities. You don't see connections. You just like things that come your way that could be potential good things, you just don't perceive them because your nervous system is so attuned to what is not safe. So when you dissolve that in your body, when your nervous system comes into the ability to be in a parasympathetic state, regulation is not always being in a parasympathetic state, but when you can move between states more fluidly without getting locked into that survival response, you will be able to perceive more of the life that is in front of you, more opportunities, more connections, more intimacy, more joy, more success, all of those things become more accessible because you're, you're able to literally perceive them better.